In the labyrinth of love and conflict, passion and rebellion, our characters find themselves once again tangled in the web of their own making. Jackson's voice is heavy with desperation. Celine, I have always loved you. Celine, caught off guard, stammers, What? Jackson, with a tone of frustration, repeats, I said I love you, damn it. Celine, her voice shaking with anger, responds, Screw you, Jackson. You can't treat me like excrement and then tell me you love me. Jackson, attempting to salvage the situation, pleads, I have already told you I am willing to compromise. What more do you want? Celine, filled with defiance, retorts, This is how you show your love. I don't want it. Jackson, growing desperate, pleads, Just stop pretending. Don't you think I see it? You disobey me. You give me this terrible attitude just to get my attention. Well, you have it now. Just stay. We can work this out. Celine, her voice shaking with emotion, says, I never wanted your attention and I never wanted this. Just let me go. But Jackson, undeterred, insists, Stop pretending. Suddenly, Alpha Alexander enters, his voice booming, Stop it! He lands a punch on Jackson and turns to Celine. We are leaving now. Celine, bewildered, asks, What about my things? With a tone of reassurance, Alexander responds, I have everything you'll ever need. As our characters exit, leaving a stunned Jackson behind, we are left to wonder, what comes next? What does the future hold for Celine, Jackson and Alexander? The threads of fate continue to weave their intricate, unpredictable patterns. Stay tuned as the story unfolds in Fated to My Forbidden Alpha Part 24.